Hi guys, um, sorry this video is up late, it was supposed to be up yesterday. Um, don't mind Alyssa, she's fell asleep, she's going to sleep for the night. Um, it is half past six and she's fell asleep. So don't mind me either. <laughs> um, the vlog, this um, video was meant to be up yesterday but everything was going wrong up, I swear. I felt really, really ill yesterday with with a cold. I feel much better now, I made a herbal remedy, I feel better now. And um, the internet went down, oh my god, everything went wrong. Um, <coughs> but yeah, um, so that's why the, the video wasn't up yesterday, which is like, because I do Mondays. Um, but yeah, everything was going wrong, it's nuts. So it's like, right, this, <coughs> excuse me, this week's video, just let me, um, Zoom in a bit. Look at the state of me. Um, this week's video is about being an a empath and how to deal with it. Uh, um, <coughs> basically, what an empath is is someone that can feel other people's emotions and pick up on um, things that are going around, like um, in the atmosphere, basically. Um, I am an empath, which, sorry that was my phone, um, I'm an empath and I didn't actually understand um, what it meant until this topic came up, because um, I, oh, excuse me, I've got an itch, um, I always used to feel like this all the time, like, <clears throat> I would know if someone's had an argument in a house, if I've gone to a friend's house, or know if someone's had an argument, because I'd feel it's in the atmosphere when people were there and then I started to feel horrible and how they felt um, and I always feel I can it's weird this but this happens to me um, I can feel what people other people are feeling from a distance as well um, like um, if you remember um, October rain she was on here for a while um, I picked up on something that was wrong with her and she's like, how did you know that? <laughs> I'm like, yes. Um, I pick up on all kinds of stuff. I pick up on if my sister's not feeling well, um, if my mum's not feeling well. I can pick up on atmosphere that's coming from next door, basically. Um, oh, God, my computer's acting dippy today. Um, so, yeah, it's it can be hard sometimes. Like, I can pick up on people that have upset and then I feel horrible. One thing that happened today that really, really, really got my, oh my gosh, um, I felt what this person was feeling and pretty bluntly it nearly made me cry. Um, I felt sick and scared. Well, I'm not, I'm not scared of nothing basically, but I felt this person's fear. Um, if you didn't read my status on Facebook, oh my gosh, you're going to be shocked at what you're going to hear now. I was, I took my little girl to school, I took Alyssa to school, um, and then I was going to my mum's house, and then there was these two girls, they must have been around about 17, 18, um, and there was this um, young man, he must have been about 23, 24, in a wheelchair, he was a, a black man, um, and um, not that it's got anything to do with the colour of the skin, but you know what I mean, just describing what happened. Um, <coughs> It was a black man, and he obviously had learning difficulties, um, but he was able to get about by himself in his wheelchair. <sighs> Wait for it, guys, seriously. Um, these girls, basically, was taking the pee out of this man. He had learning difficulties, he was a black man, and the names they were, they were calling him a spacker, I do not like, do you know like when someone's spasticated? This is what he was, they were saying to this man. Um, and they were calling him um, the N-word. And I hate, I hate that word. Um, and they were calling him a black B, black C. And holy crap, I felt the pain from this man. It was horrible. It hit me like a brick to the head. It was horrible. My stomach, <coughs> um seized up, I felt a, a fear inside of me, um, an anger, and the shit hit the fan basically, I went mental, and I think my power kind of kicked in, because I wished that, 
I know you shouldn't wish harm on somebody, but um, I thought, I wish, I hope something happens and they get what comes to them. Next minute, the f one of them slipped and fell in husk shit. L I'm not bullying, not bullying, I'm being serious, this happened. I got so angry and uh, to boiling point where I don't normally curse people, but I didn't realise I did it until it happened. Um, I thought to myself, I just wish that girl would just break her bloody leg or something and she'll learn not to be such a bitch, excuse my language, to this person. Um, and the next minute, she's um, fallen over into some horse shite. So yeah, she deserved it. Um, the poor guy was upset and I felt his pain so much that my stomach turned inside out. My throat seized up. Um, it's the like my son's just come home. But yeah, this is what happens. It was horrible. And um oh no, 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 I'm just doing a video. And then like I said, yeah, this is the kind of feelings I feel. It's horrible when you pick up and stuff. But the the man said, Come here and he and he gave me a hug and he said thank you. And I waited for the bus to come and then I got him on bus. So yeah, this is the kind of thing empaths feel. They feel like um feel people's emotions and it's horrible. <sighs> my brother's my son's just come in and say hello. Hello. Everyone thinks that I didn't have any other children apart from Melissa, but <laughs> this is my son, Brandon, he's 11. So yeah, this is the kind of thing empaths feel, it's hard uh, <coughs> picking up on other people's emotions. Um, but yeah, the way Brandon, um, people are so nasty, aren't they? Um, but yeah, um, the way I can deal with it is I like, like to be around nature um, and Brandon, I'm, on, I'm doing a video. Um, be around nature and, and um, be around my animals basically because that's what calms me down and makes me feel better that's the only way I deal with it anyway um, but yeah I just thought I'd share that story with you because it's absolutely disgusting what some people are like and how you feel their pain and other people's pain but yeah I thought I'd share that with you <laughs> I swear some people are so pure evil it's not even funny um, but yeah that's how empaths feel the feel other people's emotions um, and um, pain. Brandon's in the background laughing at me. <laughs> the monster. Right, guys, I'm gonna go now. Okay, I'm blessed to be.